Australians love their cherry ripe candy bars, adore their Vegemite spread, and go crazy for Monte Carlo cookies. And from now on, when Olivia Newton-John gets a craving for down under treats, she can waltz into Koala Blue, the all Aussie boutique she and Pat Farrar recently opened in Los Angeles. Last year when I was on tour, I was thinking about how I missed things about Australia, especially like Australian candy bars and milkshakes and I'd love a hot pie and sauce and I was craving all these things. That what you was that, a hot what? A hot pie, hot <laughs> pie and sauce, a meat pie and sauce. <laughs> and I came back on my birthday and on my birthday dinner I was telling Pat how I thought it'd be a great idea to open a little milk bar where all the Aussies could hang out and have a pie and a piece of pavlova and read an Aussie newspaper. The idea in my mind was to combine the milk bar with fashion mm -hmm. and bring the Australian fashion over too so it'd be a really unique type of place. And Koala Blue features some cute clothes and accessories from Australia's top designers. What few folks know about these shop owners is that they actually began singing together many years ago in London. Oh, everybody tells me so, can't buy me love. Actually, we had individual careers, uh -huh. and as it turned out, to cut a long story short, we were both in England, and Pat and myself and my mother shared an apartment for a while, and I wasn't doing much, and Pat had a contract over there, so she offered to split her contract with me so we could join up as a double act, really just not to be lonely. Money can't buy you love, but a few bucks will get you this little outfit, all the rage in the outback, and what about a one-of-a-kind jumper? That's a sweater to you and me, mates. But this lovely creation isn't for sale. It belongs to Auntie Edna. That's Australia's Dame Edna, played by female impersonator Barry Humphreys, who helped celebrate the opening of this store and the authentic Aussie milk bar by treating us to the recipe for an Aussie milkshake, something Olivia insists they do better down under. Well, our milkshakes are different. The American milkshakes are very thick, and I never liked them. And ever since I've lived here, I always get annoyed because they, they're like so thick and Australian milkshakes were really, it was milk, you know, and with chocolate flavoring and ice cream and malt and they were fantastic. Really? <laughs> <laughs> oh! Scrumptious lips! <laughs> <laughs> you ready for your ride? Yeah. Oh, scrum me, yummy! <laughs> oh, Auntie, you haven't had a glass. Oh, I'll drink out of the tin. <laughs> <laughs> 